So you're working in Rhino on a project, or maybe you're crafting a new template, and you're making new layers and assigning colors to them and wondering, what color should I make my layers? Well, any color really, doesn't matter that much. Well, just not these two colors. So I just launched a new instance of Rhino here, and it opened up a default template that comes in with a stack of layers, each with its own different layer color here. And I wanted to use this to illustrate a couple of colors that you never want to make into your layer colors. So I'm gonna zoom out here and create a couple of rectangles to use as some sample geometry. And I'll select them, great. So the first layer color I never want to use is anything that's the same or even close to my selection color. So if I come over here, and this is what not to do, kids, yellow, yellow being the default Rhino selection color, it makes it really hard to see what is and what isn't selected. Now the clever among you will have figured out that the second color that I don't wanna use is the background color. So I wouldn't want to come over here, again, this is what not to do, to come over here to the color and say 0, 0, 170 because then my geometry effectively disappears when it's not selected. So yeah, real simple, two colors you never want to set your layers to. Now I know you're probably thinking as that mouse gets ever so closer to the dislike button, gosh, I would never do that, that's so obvious. I know you wouldn't, but you might import a file where layer colors like yellow or gray are really common, like say AutoCAD. So the first thing I'm gonna to wanna to do when I import a file from another program is take a brief look at my layer colors and make sure none of them are set to either my selection or to my background color and save myself a lot of headache down the road. <laughs> 